The bird retaliated against the prickly cactus by cursing and pooping on its head. But you think that's the end of it? There's a parasitic plant seed in this poop, after leaving the bird's body, the seeds extend an antenna that probes the surface of the cactus, many seeds will die during the exploration. Once a seed probes the surface of the cactus, it waits for night to fall, because the cactus opens its stomata at night to breathe, the seeds take advantage of the water in the cactus to grow wild. When they reach maturity the next year, they burst through the surface of the cactus and produce red flowers. These parasitic plants will be like bony maggots, rooted inside the cactus, growing on the surface of the cactus. When fully blossomed, it entices hummingbirds to pollinate it, and when pollinated, it bears fruit that, like the eyes of hell, looks everywhere. The birds will visit again and carry the seeds to the next cactus, on one island, cactuses and birds live in harmony. Tall cactuses provide shelter for the boobies, and the boobies feed the cactuses with their dung, so the cactuses thrive on the island, leaving little room for other plants.